Typhoon H Seago 3 Plus Calibration. The first step is to open up the Y Ground Control software on your PC. Next, select the COM port your calibration tool is connected to. If multiple devices are connected, you'll need to make sure you select the proper COM port. Next, click on Connect, then power on the camera. When the camera initializes, it may or may not center properly. Wait until the camera stops or has a consistent outcome. Next, click on the Yaw Encoder Erase, then Zero Phase Erase, then Accelerometer Erase, and finally, Front Erase. Do not select IMU Temperature Erase, as this will delete the temperature calibration process, which will require the camera to be sent back to the factory. Next, select Yaw Encoder Kelly. This will set the camera to rotate about the yaw axis. Once completed, the camera will stop and the wide ground control program will give you a success message. If unsuccessful, erase the yaw encoder and retry. Next, manually move the camera until it is facing forward and the gimbal is level. Hold it in this position and select pre-front Cali. Next, select phase Cali. This will set the camera to move in all direction to the maximum and minimum values. This will also set the level position of the camera. Wait till the camera stops and you can indicate a green light that emits from the camera. Next, power cycle the camera and reconnect the Y ground control program. Next, select accelerometer calibration. This will set the gimbal to move once again in all directions. This is calibrating the movement of the camera in relation to the values of the gyro. This process will take a while. Do not move the camera or tool during this process. Once completed, the camera will stop moving. The camera may not stop exactly to the front of the tool, however, once hooked up to the aircraft, the gimbal should face straight forward and level. Verify the camera operation on a Typhoon H. This concludes this portion of your Typhoon H training.